I think it's always important to, I guess, take care of the people around you. If you focus on the community you're in and improving that immediate area, I think it makes a huge difference in everyone's lives. Just a very small thing uh, can make a huge difference. And I think that's kind of the, the message that I want Roses to imbue. My name is Mason Wartman, and we're in Rose's Fresh Pizza, business I started about three years ago. I was working in New York in finance, um, and I had gotten a little bit bored of just the daily routine of going into the office and doing much of the same stuff. Uh, that I had been doing for, for a couple of years. Um, and I saw these dollar pizza spots throughout New York and Manhattan, and I thought it was a business that could work back home in Philadelphia. So I left my job in New York and came back to start Roses. A uh, blog writer posted about us and wrote about how the pizza was pretty good and that we found ourselves feeding a lot of homeless people because it was affordable food. Somebody read that, came in, and offered to buy a slice for the next person that came in short. Thought it was a great idea. And uh, we feed about 100 homeless people every day at this point. We give right. away thousands of slices. So if you want to donate to someone in need, you can come in and you can buy pizza for yourself and soda for yourself. And then um, you just tell the person at the register that you want to buy a slice, two slices, a couple more slices for someone in need. It's a dollar for a donated slice, just like a slice that you eat. And you can write a post-it note for each slice that you donate and put them on our wall. And then when a homeless person comes in, he can take it off the wall, trade it in for a slice of pizza at the counter. You see here. Oh, perfect. Oh. Several homeless people benefited from our system and, you know, use that as an opportunity to improve their lives, to save money, reinvest in other aspects of, uh, of their lives, maybe get a nicer set of clothes for a job interview, get a job and then a place. It's been great to be a part of, I guess, individual transformations. Sometimes the homeless, our homeless visitors will write messages back. One guy, always super nice guy, um, he was homeless and um, got free food. Uh, one day he wrote a, a poem that's actually on the wall over there. Hadn't seen him for a while. A couple months later he walked in, dressed super nice. I, I barely even recognized him. Like, uh, it's, it's crazy. Um, I guess the transformation that, that took place. And, you know, is back in touch with his family. He's been clean for, you know, a couple years at this point, I guess. And he's a, a pretty good friend of mine now. I always imagined kind of going to Wall Street and doing well and then giving back after my career was over. And when I started Roses, I knew that we'd help a few homeless visitors just because they could naturally afford the food. But I didn't know that it would be on such a scale. I'm really happy that it worked out this way. I just encourage other people that are watching this to, um, I guess, implement a similar 
program and try similar projects in their communities. Um, and it would make a huge difference uh, across the world if that happened.